When the last male northern white rhino, Sudan, died in 2018, the animal's sperm was saved and the clock started ticking. The remaining members of the species, two females, are unable to carry a pregnancy to term. We really made the impossible possible. Scientists have announced a breakthrough at a press conference in Berlin after they used in vitro fertilization to impregnate a surrogate. The southern white rhino's 70-day pregnancy, they say, proved the concept works. It's quite a kind of roller coaster because it's a sweet, bitter symphony. Uh, we, we actually achieved what we worked for for years and we are extremely happy about that. But tragically, the female and her embryo died of an unrelated bacterial infection. Even so, the scientists call it a success. They intend to repeat the procedure next time with a northern white rhino embryo created in a lab. Whatever it takes, whatever humanly possible, to make sure that these animals do not uh, disappear from the face of the earth. Northern white rhinos once roamed freely in East and Central Africa, but persistent poaching for their horns, sold illegally for thousands of dollars, brought the species to this precipice. Here we have a potential lifeline. This conservation expert says boosting the populations of endangered species is only part of the solution. What it now needs is it needs this broader course of planning to be able to bring the species into a situation where it has a chance to establish itself in the wild. That means protecting both the animals and the habitat they need to survive. The rhino team hopes to see northern white rhino calves born by surrogate within three years as they race to prevent its permanent extinction. Heidi Petrachik, Global News, Halifax.